Hello everyone! After receiving numerous requests on Sony X90K preferred setting, here you go. I'm going to start by commending Sony for having nice remote. It's not slippery, nicely weighted, and the best part is there are four direct access buttons for YouTube, Netflix, Disney Plus, and Prime Video. Now let's move on to the recommended settings. Please remember this is not calibration. This is just a recommended settings. It's preference over reference. And to start, go to the picture mode and choose custom settings. Because of the neutrality of Sony's Ambient Optimization Pro, I usually turn on the light sensor, auto luminance, and auto tone curve. I bring down the backlight brightness level to 30 and black level to 48. From there, I go to black adjust and set it to low instead of off. And then I bring down sharpness to 30 and set reality creation to 32. Again, this is not reference, this is my preference. And since most of us watch mostly streaming, I set random noise reduction, digital noise reduction, and smooth gradation all set to low. These will improve the apparent quality of the streaming video. I then set Cinemotion to high, and I set power savings to off. And as far as basic advanced color temperature, I set red and green gain to maximum, blue to minus four, red bias to seven, green bias to zero, and blue bias to minus two. I come up with these number after averaging the last five X90K TVs I professionally calibrated. The next setting is HDR tone mapping. In order to access this functionality, you have to play something that's in HDR on your TV. You can choose gradation preferred for more accurate HDR tone mapping. Or if you tend to watch your TV with some lights on, you can choose brightness preferred. So that's it, it's quick and dirty. Again, this is not calibration, this is just a preferred settings. So now please leave your comment down below and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much for watching and goodbye.